What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So it's week four of our practice pad tutorials and this week we've got a banger. I call this the two, three, four, five warm up, or sometimes the speed illusion, which I've used in the title of the video because I know it entices some of my students. But this isn't about speeding up and getting faster. It's just the name of the exercise because it gives us the illusion of going faster when we're not. Let me explain. So this warm up is a one bar loop in four, four, and on each beat of that bar, we're using a different subdivision and the subdivision um, adds an extra note each time. So let me explain. Beat one is an eighth note. Beat two is a triplet, beat three is a sixteenth note, and beat four is a quintuplet. Let me just quickly explain a quintuplet to those of you who have not heard of it before, or tried playing it, or maybe haven't learnt it yet. So a quintuplet is just a grouping of five, and I know your first question is going to be, well, how do you count that? So if we imagine it's like a sixteenth note with an extra one on the end, we count a sixteenth note as one e and a. I like to count a, a, a quintuplet with g at the end for the fifth note, one e and a g, because it just flows nicely. One e and a g, two e and a g, three e and a g, four e and a g, and that way we know we're, we're working out our subdivision correctly. So let's start off just by practicing playing a grouping of five, just so we can get comfortable in that subdivision. So I'm gonna have the click on nice and slow, you can play along with me, and you'll notice obviously, because it's an odd grouping, you are gonna be changing hands on each beat. So beat one will be your right hand, beat two left, etc. One, two, Three and a good forty and a good one. Good job everyone, well done. Uh, if you're struggling with that, by the way, please don't worry. This took me a while to figure out when I first learned it. So pause the video, stick with that a little bit longer, even slow down your metronome if you need to, and just make sure you really understand that subdivision and can feel groupings of five over, over a quarter note pulse. And as soon as you're comfortable with that, you can, you can catch up with the rest of us. So for the rest of us, what we're now gonna do is the same thing again, but the last two beats of every quintuplet we're gonna play as a double. That way the sticking will be right, left, right, left, left. And you'll see why we're practicing this in a couple minutes. But for now, let's do it. One, two, three, and a go, four, and a go, one, and a go, two, and a go, three, and a go, four, and a go. Awesome stuff, well done everyone. I think we are now ready to tackle the two, three, four, five, the speed up illusion warm up. Uh, so let's piece this all together. Just a reminder, if you wanna download the notation for this lesson, a link can be found in the description where you can download a PDF from my website for free. The reason we just practiced that quintuplet with the double at the end is so that when we do piece it all together, um, after every bar, we're gonna switch which hand starts off the entire pattern. So. We're gonna start this nice and slow at 70 BPM, notation up on the screen, and we're gonna play four bars. So that gives each hand two bars worth of leading. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Well done everyone, good job. So here we go, we're gonna ramp it up a little bit. Let's challenge ourselves. We're now gonna try it at 100 BPM. So same thing again, click, notes on screen with me. You've gotta play along. One, two, three, four. Boom, there we go, well done everyone. I hope you found this lesson useful and interesting and more importantly, I hope you found it a bit of a challenge. We're only ever gonna grow on the drums if we start to challenge ourselves. So I left this one uh, till the end of the series of the practice pad videos because I kind of assumed it would be the most challenging, but I'm interested to know how you got on with them. So leave a comment down below for me. Let me know how you found all of these exercises I've been posting and do all the usual stuff, you know, like the video, subscribe, ring all the bell and all that stuff. <laughs> You're sick of hearing us say that, so I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna keep saying it. But there we go. Remember you can download the notation from my website to help you practice and take this away and, and learn it. Uh, yeah, uh, I, I'm interested to see how you guys get on with this. So if you'd like to tag me in any videos of you playing it, feel free to do so. My Instagram tag is up on screen. And that's it for today. Awesome stuff. Well, you know where to find me. I'll be live streaming again on Friday. So hopefully to see all your lovely faces there. 
and uh, hopefully raise loads of money for charity. So that is it. I hope you stay. I hope you're staying safe. By the way, I hope everyone's well. Uh, and yeah, if you're allowed out at the minute, do so. Go go for a walk. Just uh, stay away from everyone. <laughs> and I'll uh, yeah, I'll see you very soon. Whatever you're doing today, stay in and smash it.